Welcome to the Tech Mill Update. I'm Kiana Danielle, CEO of Investiva.com. On Thursday, Bank of Japan's Kuroda warned of overseas risks, signaling readiness to adjust policy. But the RBNZ governor said they are unlikely to need unconventional monetary policy tools. In Europe, the outlook for euro area real GDP growth has been revised down for 2019 and 2020. And in the UK, Prime Minister Johnson said that he will not ask for Brexit extension. To end the trading week, on Friday we'll be looking at the US durable goods orders and personal income and spending. Today I'm looking at the Kiwi dollar pair which is still trying to bounce off the key support level of 0.6258 a level that had not been seen since September 2016 on the four-hour time frame the pair has really is really trying hard to pierce through the lower band of the Ichimoku cloud but the bears and the bulls appear to be going head-to-head -head each and every time at the moment, the only bullish signal that we have is the angled double bottom chart pattern that could be in the process of forming, but that is not a bullish enough sentiment for me to bet on. Of course, trading in the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our social media. I'll get back to you with more updates next week.